It is surfer girl time. I've got primos and it is time to get Mulani. At least, hopefully. I have 20 pulls. We had this reset, the shop reset, so I got pulls from there. Also, I finally cleared the whole Imaginarium Theater, except for that harder challenge at the end that I can't remember the name of. But I got 8 stars, which I'm very stoked about because I haven't been able to do that before. And also, I've been doing quite a bit of exploration in that land. We have 68% here, 22, 40, and 36. So we've been working our way through. I've done, I think, one world quest, which is this one here. But we've been working our way through. I've also finished this entire event and gotten two of the pools from here, which is three pools. So that now means we have a decent amount of pools from Milani. I am currently sitting on, I think, 60 pity, 59 pity. So that should, 69, 79, that should bring us to hopefully a five star. Although we did get Navia last, so we have to win the 50-50, which I am praying we do because I really want Mulani. As I said in my last video on my main account, I you know wasn't originally going for Mulani. I was more looking at Kinnich, but I love Mulani's personality, so I want Mulani. So we are in the springs, and it is time to bring home Surfer Girl. We get a four star straight away. That'll bring us up to 69 pity, I think. Are we going to see a Kachina? Please give us, thank you very much, a Kachina. I have, I think it's the first one I've gotten pulling for Mulani because I have done a couple pulls off camera before this and in my last video. Okay, now, 79 pity. This should be our five star. There we go. Now, please be Mulani. Come on. Dragon's Bane. That's Shin Yen. Okay, double four star. Come on. Oh, I hate it when it goes far into pity. Mulani. Come on, don't do this. D <clears throat> you are not Mulani. Uh, double five star? No. Great, we get the two really bad pyro, pyro claymores in one pool. That's lovely. I have three more pulls. Come on, Mulani. Last pull. We get a four star. If it's a Kachina, I'll take it. It's a Barbara. That gives us another pull. Which, this is going to be our Mulani. No. Now we have... Well, we have Kachina C3. We have Shin Yen C5. And we have DRC1. That's not exactly how I was hoping that would go. Hmm, interesting. Okay. So I think, by the looks of things, we are currently sitting at 14 days. I doubt I'm going to be able to get enough primos for Mulani in 14 days. So it is most likely going to be Kinich who I'll be getting next. Which is a bit of a shame because I... I mean, not really. I originally wanted to get Kinich, but I also kind of wanted Mulani. But because that isn't a very long video so far and I can't get another video recorded in the amount of time. I think I'm just going to go do some more stuff in Natland I reckon. So I think what I'm going to do is do some exploration and I don't know try to 100% one of the regions probably the springs one because that's the one I'm closest to at the moment. I think I just need to get a couple more stuff sort of in this rough vicinity. Also, I should probably do these quests because that's going to give us good stuff. But before we get stuck into the primo gem grindy side of things, I am going to do this uh, tribal thingy, tribal chronicles, because I need to do that to get the Natlan glider. And also it is in this region, so I, it needs to be done. And because we didn't get Mulani, I'm going to mess around and use some of my fun teams now because Mulani's a really fun playstyle, and I, that's why I kind of wanted her, but we didn't get it, so we get to use my fun team that I enjoy. If I don't want to do damage, I just kind of want to mess around, and that's my plunge hutao. Oh yeah, I just remembered. I don't know how I forgot about this, but these are the story quests for the characters. The, the Tribal Chronicles are Mulani's story quests, and or at least this one is. And then they'll have Kachinas and Kinichas, I imagine, then? 
Yeah, because see, if we go into here, into into the story quests, there is no Mulani story quest. These are Mulani story quests and, you know, Kinnich's and Kachina's. These are the story quests here. So I'm basically just doing their story quests. Speaking of which, I need to do a lot of other story quests. Okay, now I just realized I've been doing this quest for like a couple hours, or an hour and a half or something now. And it's still got about an hour left. So... As it is late, I'm going to get back to this tomorrow. So yeah, I'll see you tomorrow and we'll finish off this bit that we have to deal with over here. Okay, so we are back. I uh, may have got a little bit carried away. Because I was just doing my farming to get daily commissions up here somewhere. Or sort of this area. And I may have got a little bit carried away. And now I have 68, 44 and 53% exploration. That's 41, not 44. So uh, just a little bit carried away, but that's fine. I also continued to get carry away, carried away and I finished off the Mulani story quest thing. So that's done now. But in doing that carried awayness, I managed to get one of these, which means that I can go to this thing down here and get, I think it's three chests, of luxurious, precious, and exquisite. And... A couple five-star artifacts, I think. So, let's go see what we get in here. This is a lot of five-star artifacts, actually. I thought we were getting chests, but no, just a lot of five-star artifacts. So, let me have a look. Let's see if we're going to get perfect pieces for Mulani. Because then there'll be no reason why we shouldn't get Mulani, because we have perfect pieces for her. I mean, we did get two pieces that could work. Okay. Well, now that out of the way, let's get to... The last bit of the thing I need to do, which is 100%ing this area. First thing we are doing is jumping down to around here, I think. Because there is a Shrine of Depth. And they give you quite a bit of exploration points, or whatever you'd call it. But without further ado, let's get into 100%ing off the Springs area. Then bring home Mulani. Yeah, that's brought us straight up to 76% exploration, that one Shrine of Depth. So... They are definitely pretty pretty big for exploration gainage. That's a word now. Uh, now, I may have made a mistake. I am very close to getting this pyroculus up here, I think. But uh, we are running out of stamina, and I've already used one of these foods. Now, I'm just going to sit here for, like, three minutes until that food resets so I can not die. Now, I'm sure there is probably a better way to get up here there's probably something down there that i should have used to ride up here but oh well we are using this method i also probably should have swapped to kazuha because then i could have done this but again oh well okay after too long we restore stamina now we have five minutes before the next one so hopefully we can get to the top this would be really painful if i just waited that entire time and we can't get to the top thank you very very much Next chest or collectible thing. Ooh, we get to craft this one, which means we can now, I know where that is. We can get go get some more artifacts. Okay, we will get to that artifacts in a second. Let's just finish off this area. We have a couple more chests, a bit of an underground section. We are currently sitting at 85% exploration. So with what we have left, I think we should to hit 100? I mean, we should because I'm 100%ing everything I can see on the actual interactive map. So, that should be 100% unless they haven't added everything to the interactive map, which they don't for some reason. They add most of it, but there's always inevitably new stuff pop up every now and then. Ooh, I know what's in here. This is very difficult for Tui boss. Hmm, okay, give me a minute. Let's go grab this chest and Pyroculus first. And then we put together a team that won't die straight away. I just need to watch all of those little red lines. And make sure I stay very, very far away from them. We've got to survive a minute before we can get... What's the name back? Alakino back. So, Farina solo. See, this is when Alakino would be nice. Because now he's frozen and not being a pain. Alakino is back, but probably not for very long, because she doesn't heal. We need to get her burst up to actually get her to heal. 
which is not fun when she's on 100 HP. What is happening to your damage? Why are you only doing like hits of 6k? What What is happening to our damage? This guy must have some crazy resistances because we are doing like zero damage. Normally, I like you notice it's up like 80 or so k. We are doing significantly less than that right now. So he must have some pretty big resistances. Oh no, okay, this isn't going well. Um, let's make sure Layla doesn't die. Can we, do we have food? Uh, revival food, we have one. Okay, that'll, that'll do. We are so close. Please just survive a little bit longer. Okay, come on, Alakino. Finish this off, please. Boom. There we go. That was not very fun. How many? We just got like 20 or something. 24 drops in one go. Jeez, okay. But that's done. I don't like that. That was not a fun boss. Now, I'm pretty sure that's about everything on the surface collected here. But it still says we're at 95. So, I'm assuming that this area here is part of this mountain. Well, I missed a chest over here. So, I'll go get this. But I don't know how big this area is because I was just doing over here and I thought for sure this would be part of it, but apparently not. Well, that chest brings us to, yeah, 96. Oh, well, I don't know how far out they count the springs, so I'm just going to go kind of far out and see if that increases our exploration because there is two chests over here quite a ways out. I doubt they will. But there's also a couple other stuff a little bit closer that I can try out as well. I'm just kind of confused at the moment. Because according to the interactive map, I have everything there. Yeah, well, here's not counted as springs. This is counted as the other place, which is what I expected. So what about on top of this little mountain here? Because there is a chest on top of this. Does this count as the springs? This does. Okay. There's only about two things I can see that may possibly be in the area. There's a little mini game challenge thing over here and there is another annoying boss thing. Nope, that one counted as the mountains, which just leaves this thing up here, which I should probably put a better team for. And that is the world boss challenge thing. Why can't I remember the name of them? Local legend that is still in the mountains what am i missing how about this there is a luxurious chest that you can get over here does this count as the springs and if so i think this is the last thing we need does this count as the springs no that still counts as the mountains what am i missing hello i am so very confused the very last thing i can think of is using this thing is the very last thing I can think of, and I'm not 100% sure where that is, but I think it's this way somewhere. I had the right idea, just wrong direction. The thing is over this way, and this is the last thing I can think of, because, yeah, I don't really know. Let's hope, though, that this is what is the problem. So, boom. There we go. Now we can claim a bunch of five-star artifacts again. Okay, there we go. Has that done it? Has that brought us to 100%? Yes, it has. There we go. Okay, that's what was missing. But there we go. Boom. The Toyak, Toyak, Toy Toyak Springs is now 100%ed. Hell yeah. Let's go. That took way too long. An hour and a half in this recording, and it would have been probably about similar in the last one. Now, let's see if we got any good artifacts out of that. Okay, potentially decent. Also potentially decent. I don't know if Milani wants... That could work on a physical. I don't know if Milani wants attack or HP, but I have one of each. Crit rate. I'll keep it. Okay, that's pretty good. Again, not great, but it'll do. That's not great either. We have these. 245 of them. Which should give us quite a few very nice rewards and primos and good stuff from here that will get us a very very nice eight levels which gives us like 400 primos or something plus a bunch of standard pools 
and a key that we can use at a shrine. So let's go use that key at a shrine. Come on, show me your curry. Did he just say show me your curry? I think it's supposed to say courage, but I, I cut him off. But that now means we have nothing else we can throw into statues or trees or anything. We have a 10 pool already, hell yeah. And two primos, no, two standard pools. Plus, oh my god, no, two in two limited pools and four standard pools. It is 10 o'clock at night, my brain is not working. What? Ooh, this is a good sign. Okay. You know what, I'll take it. I think that's incredibly early pity. Like, I'm pretty sure we got C1 Kaching not that long ago. Now we have C2. Yep. 20 pity ago, we got C1. Now we have C2 Kaching. Hell yeah. That is a good sign. Two more of those pulls. Let's go Mulani. Okay, not quite. We get Bennett. That's a free pull because he's already C6. Okay, three more pulls. Come on, Mulani. I actually think it's more than three pulls. Yeah, it is definitely more than three pulls. Come on. Give us... That's a four star. I'll take Kachina, please. Not even a character. Sick. You can do this. Please give us five star. Come on. Five star. Last pull. Please be a five star. That's not a five star. Ah, well, I can't say I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. I mean, I did a lot of work and I would have loved it if we, you know, could have got that. But yeah, I was sort of expecting that. I would have loved the Milani, but it seems that we'll be getting a Kinich. Unless we can get like a bunch of primos in 13 days, which I mean, we could. I'll still be doing a bunch of stuff and hopefully getting some primos but we are only sitting at five pity now nah, that that would be probably 20 i'd say so the likelihood of that is not super high although it would be very 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 nice if we could get mulani we do have five more pulls here so i will keep pulling but we shall see unless i can get a lot of pulls before mulani's banner finishes then we'll probably not be getting Mulani. But that's a wrap for today's video. Because it is 10 o'clock at night or 10.30 at night. And I need to get this edited and posted tonight. So that's fun. But I mean, we got some stuff, I guess. We have now C2 Kaching and C1 Dia, which I would have happily lived without. Because Mulani would have been much nicer. But we also have this Springs area 100%ed, which, I mean, that's pretty cool. And the rest of the world's at 55, 73, and 69 for the rest of Natlan. And I will get that all 100%ed at some point. I'm going to leave it here. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you like this content, do consider subscribing. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. And good. Bye. Bye.